quick heads up guys there's a blog link down below in the description if you want to go check it out there are all the steps written down and redacted in english but can be translated in any language possible so if you're not very fluent in english you should definitely go check it out with that said and out the way let's get into it quick disclaimer i'm currently using nox player it's a uh, emulator for windows which allows me to have Max 2D on my computer, but you will probably be following on your Android device, which is fine, so continue as nothing happened. Now, I have a simple scene setup, setup with a start button, and that is it. And I want to transfer, I want this to be the first scene uh, of my app. Now, the first thing I'm going to do for that, before I show you how to change scenes, is actually set it up to be the first scene of my app. So, with this setup, I'm going to go and click on settings. I'm going to go down to start in scene, and as you can see it says scene 1. Uh, this isn't the scene that I made, you need to go down onto main menu. Now you will have none of these yet because you haven't created them. To create a scene, you have to go to the monitor icon, click, click create new scene, type a random name, probably one that makes sense so you can understand and find it later on and click OK to create a new scene. I've already done that and I have actually three scenes. I have my main menu, my game, which is the first scene, and the you died screen, the game over screen, which is dead. So with main menu, as you can see, as the starting scene, I'm going to click on the start button, open up the properties tab, go down to our new text object here, which we can rename to start but you don't have to we're going to go down to add component and we're going to add a box collider now this will allow us to detect when the text itself is clicked and once you have that box collider added we don't need to change any of these properties we can click on scripts here or here with the scripts that um, workspace open we can click on the plus icon we can go down on screen on touch that would be for the entire screen we need an object on touch make sure to read that one well we're looking for the object not the screen with the object on touch we need to find a load scene the load scene found here we can plug these two in together it says here works only with box collider which is what we just did we added a box collider we can set on touch up, set scene game as in scene one. If we try this out now, when we press the scene, we arrive in our game. I hope this video helped, and if it did, then make sure to leave a comment and a like. Uh, if it didn't help, then you can put some go check out my blog in the description. If you still don't understand, then you can actually comment on the video and ask me any question you want. Thank you very much for watching. This is a simple and different tutorial to what I'm used to, but I'm hoping to do a few more Max 2D tutorials, and I want to continue doing my Army 3D tutorials that you should definitely go check out if you don't know what they are.